Hi, let me share with you something that you can do at home, which is how to check your own pulse. My name is Dr. Ko Kok Wei. I'm the consultant cardiologist and electrophysiologist in Subang Jaya Medical Center. Pulse is an external measure of heartbeat and heart rhythm, which is one of your vital signs. Now, why would you want to check your own pulse? Number one, it is because it is a good idea to know your own baseline pulse and what is normal for you. Number two, early detection of an abnormal pulse can save your life. Let me show you how to check your own pulse. The easiest way to check a pulse is on your wrist. Firstly, make sure that you sit down and relax for at least five minutes. Avoid caffeine, cigarettes, or exercise perhaps about 30 minutes before. Then, use your first two fingers and place it on the side of the wrist nearer to your base of your thumb. You may need to move your finger around until you find the pulsation of your pulse. Count the number of your pulses for 30 seconds and times 2 to get your pulse per minute. For example, if you get 40 beats in 30 seconds, when you times 2, you get your pulse rate of 80 beats per minute. Normal people will have a heart rate ranging from 50 to 100 beats per minute. Also equally important to take note of the rhythm of your pulse. A normal pulse rhythm should be steady and regular like this. If you have an irregular pulse like this, that is something you should be worried about because it could mean that you might be having a heart rhythm condition called atrial fibrillation, which can possibly lead to a stroke. Any rate that is persistently more than 100 beats per minute or slower than 50 beats per minute, you should get it checked with your general practitioner or cardiologist. It will be good if you can check your pulse from time to time because some rhythm abnormalities do not present with any symptoms at all. Also note that most of these abnormal rhythm can come and go intermittently. You might want to check it more often, especially if you are having symptoms of palpitation, missing beat, shortness of breath, chest discomfort, or dizziness. If you are not sure, please do approach the doctors. Remember, know your pulse and it can potentially save your life because every heartbeat matters.